promise. Yeah, this is so easy. Ouch! Relax, relax, relax. Relax, Deepa. Relax, relax. <laughs> it was bad? No. <laughs> Guys, you would not believe what I'm going to do today and I'm so scared. I'm going to get vaccinated. And I'm super scared, not only because of the vaccine, but because I hate injections. I am so afraid of it. So wish me luck and I'm taking you guys with me. Okay, I am so scared. I have not left the house yet. But anyway, it is a drive through um, which is what I wanted in the first place. I told myself once they do things properly and we don't have to go into a health center or any sort of facility and line up and stuff and get this once they do a drive through and we can stay you know within the safety of our own vehicle and social distance and all Alright, thank you. Have a good day. I'll try, I wouldn't shake, I promise. Yeah, this is so Ouch! Relax, relax. Relax, relax. relax Deepa. Relax, relax. <laughs> it 
nos va no <risa> Thank you. Thank you. It wasn't so bad. All right, thanks. Have a good day on UBC. Okay. Oh my God, I'm sweating. I am, I am sweating under this mask. So much. I'm real sweat. We had to go under the observation. Yeah. I can't believe we came and get the vaccine. Okay, guys, face yeah. vaccine down. Yeah. yeah, I would hand sanitize. Just I'm not saying we leave the vaccinated, not the first one. I I'm not so afraid of the vaccine as much as I was afraid of just the injection. Okay, thanks. We're going to the observation area. drink some eats <laughs> vaccine or Sinopharm some people are saying Sinopharm but I believe it's Sinopharm right so I feel great by the way uh, I was super nervous I did not even want to take the vaccine just yet um, mainly because I am afraid of uh, needles I do not like injections at all mind you I do have tattoos but anyway that <laughs> I really screamed on the place for that too but I am afraid of injections, so I was really, really, you know, nervous about it. And then I was like, neither here nor there with the vaccine. But I did say to myself, I also did not like the system that was set for us, for the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. I did not like that we had to line up in a health center that has COVID positive patients. You have to line up in there, go into, I mean, the one that is closest to me, you have, you had to actually go into the building to get your vaccine which is silly because they are covid positive people in there and then you have to line up and you're supposed to be social distancing you know i mean it's the chance of you know getting infected but anyway i didn't like that pro that system at all and i did say to myself we have too many savannas too many ovals too many huge facilities in trinidad that is not being used that could have been used for a drive through um vaccine uh vaccine point or you know vaccine location so i did say to myself when the government does that plan it properly so that you know we can choose to drive through don't come out of or out of our vehicle and you know comfortably and safely go through and you know get your vaccine then i will take advantage of that 
So because that came up became available, I decided to take that chance. Me and my family, we all went and we got vaccinated, our first shot, and um, we're fine. We all feel great. Yesterday I felt a little bit tired, but I think it's because I probably overeat when I got home, and I think that would just make me feel <laughs> tired. But I do not feel not even my arms. My arms don't even feel tender. Um, I know some people were saying they felt like somebody, you know, like cuffed them really hard on their arm. I don't, I don't feel that at all. I don't feel anything. Like I can squeeze my hands really, really, you know, a lot, and you know, I don't feel anything at all. Um, I don't. I did not get any headaches. I did not get any side effects at all. Thank God. But this is just the second day, and we're told to take it easy. You know, take it light, take your rest. So on keep paracetamol or panadol close by in case of pain we're not getting all three of us we're not getting any body pain or anything like that so and even though i screamed down the place when i was getting <laughs> when i was getting the vaccine <laughs> um, it really didn't hurt it really didn't hurt much it's just in your it's, it's in my mind just knowing that i'm going to get this injection scares me it terrifies me <laughs> but you know it really wasn't bad and the entire process was great um and everybody was extremely uh, helpful and there are so many different points you have to stop and then they check your um, you have to fill out your form then they keep checking your forms and uh, you know when they ask you necessary questions or relevant questions and then you answer and then they tell you where to proceed and you know they're just the normal stop points and and then before you get your vaccine the nurses ask you if you're okay and you know if you have any questions again so you're not pressured or anything like that it is a really easy process you just have to make up your mind for those who want it um, so I'm just here, just did the vlog, just to get, just to let you all know that I was scared as well. Um, but I feel comfortable to go and even just get the vaccine now because of the system. I love the system set in place for us. You know, we are safe. Even they, they are even a, um, a what you call this, um, an observation area. So in in the health center right close to me you would have to go into the health center this is the first time before they did the drive through you would have had to go in there line up get your vaccine then you have to stay in that health center for half an hour for them to um for them to just observe in case you have any side effects so they can treat you etc which i think all of that was silly but anyway this time the observation point it is just uh, part of the car park and you stay in your car and then they have a really good system you blink your lights you pop your horn twice and then if if in case of anything and then they will come to you and then they will the doctors will come to you so every single thing is just properly put into place and it's really easy breezy safe and perfect so I definitely recommend it and there are different points in Trinidad right now. I think there's one in Wallafield, there's one in Chagaramas or Carnage. Um, there's also Golden Stadium and I'm not sure where again, but you know, do some research, see where is most convenient to you. I went to Ato Golden Stadium and I recommend it for sure. And as I said, everybody was totally, totally um, friendly and kind. You know no mean person at all and you're not pressured you can take your time and get your your first um your first shot so i hope this video was helpful and again i i have not gotten any sort of um side effects uh my next shot would be in three weeks and i will do another vlog to let you guys know how i feel then but if you are thinking of you know getting a vaccine but you're a little bit scared it was okay it's okay for me it, the entire process was fine my mom is fine and Damien is fine so yeah I definitely recommend it so I hope you guys like this video bye